नमस्ते फ्रेंड्स दिस इज अनिश मंडल एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय सीरीज हाउ टू बी अनोनिमस ऑनलाइन वी हैव कवर्ड वेरियस टॉपिक ऑन हाउ टू बाईपास इंटरनेट सेंसरशिप एंड रिस्ट्रिक्शन बट दिस टाइम वी आर गोइंग टू एड वन मोर थिंग प्राइवेसी एंड वाई इट्स नेसेसरी इन माई प्रीवियस टूटोरियल आई हैव कवर्ड वेब ब्राउजिंग यूजिंग प्रॉक्सी वीपीएन टॉर्च एंड how to be anonymous on your mobile device and in my this tutorial i am going to show you how you can be anonymous bypass the tracking email if i say how to be anonymous online it's only covered ip the location and to send and receive encrypted traffic from your system to its destination but if we think about email so email not work only on our location it works with our identity our email address whenever we send a email it's our personal email address that represent ourselves if you say like it's very simple i'll just go open tor or log in on a vpn services or open any proxy box open our mail box and done now we can send the mail but it's not that kind of simple if we are want to secure our email or protect our privacy on email because if security or privacy concern we need to protect our email from hackers and identity thieves also we need to secure our mail from spam and junk advertisers then normally people use free email service provider for their primary email address and those email service provider can dig into your email and see what the mail you have sent what the words content you use and use those as a target advertising also some security agencies might be scan your emails what you have sent they can open the mail and read it so how it can be secured for this example think ajay Ajay needs to send Neha a email, so he use his mail ID Ajay at the rate Ajay and send a mail to Neha. In normal scenario, Neha first look she received from Ajay Ajay, so okay she will open the mail, read the content, or download and open the attachment. But what if any hacker or identity thief use the same mail ID and send mail to Neha? definitely she will open the mail and it might contain any miscellaneous software or a key logger that will gain unauthorized access to that hacker and creating any fake email ids is, is more simple than a creating a new id that will be show in my practical session let's see another example uh, ajay wants to access any website web content for his study or he want to download something from internet but he requires to subscribe first or get a free membership to access those content so ajay thinks okay i'll just use my mail id to subscribe or register on that website but what happens the free content provider share this mail id with the advertisers and then those advertisers will send spam mails to ajay that how spam mail and junk mail services work remember guys there is nothing free in this world it's a matter how you are going going to repay them so as my both has scenario i'll show you the practical demo how it can be done first the fake email we can use fake email addresses for sending emails i'm going to show you first php page based hosting it's very simple you can create your own php fake page to send anonymous email let's see the demo so let's start creating our fake mail php script using the mixture of basic html forum and php code so i'll just write down the code first and then explain you step by step the instruction
so let's review the code we will use simple forum and action forum action method will be post the basic HTML tag for two tags from subject for content box we use text area including six rows and 30 columns and the action will be submit form will be closed then this is our main PHP script where we use variables for all our names and values the content use nl2br that means the person when in press enter it will be represent as a next line the header part it will replace from id as a sender this command will execute the mail function and once the mail has sent successfully we will receive notification mail sent on same day and this will close the php script and then once this php script is uploaded on a server which has mail and web hosting services including php we are able to use this all we just need to visit on that link yeah this is the code we can decide whom we want to send mail from subject and content once we click mail send it will send a mail that's how easy to create a php script to send a fake email address alternatively we can use the php script created by other users or other host for example this one or we just need to search on the internet for fake email services for sending let's see it in a practical yeah fake email sent you can see there are multiple provider available to provide you this services I use I personally use this service Here we can decide the name which we want to represent it the person which we want to send a mail to whom we want to send a mail then subject I am a winner then content we can use there is an advanced PHP script also available where we can create a basic HTML type editors and all things if you want to just see plain text I sent email the captcha into captcha and click on it send fake mail sent successfully let's see on our client site yeah now we can see the sender name and this is not this mail ID is not valid but we are able to manage to send this mail to the person that's how easy we can send fake mails if you want to after this let's see how we can use fake email addresses for receiving email there are several fake email service providers available over the internet I am going to show you most popular one for example, Mint Email Services, Gorilla Mail, and Mailinator. Gorilla Mail and Mint Email Service Provider are the temporary disposable email service provider. Once you open this website, you will get the random mail ID. You can use this same mail ID to receive mails from any services where from any services where they ask you to subscribe or register this email id is a temporary 
once you use it or you just refresh this browser or close and open this web page you will get new email id every time you do this same way on mint email you can use this email id or you can customize your own also to receive mail let's see i have customized it copy that mail address and i'll use my rise up mail id this is mail within a several second you will receive the mail so you can use those temporary disposable mail to subscribe any services or free services whom you don't trust alternatively you can use mailinator mailinator is different from this temporary disposable mail address service provider you just know you not need to register or mail in it or to use this services for example i'll use this mail address it's called pyheart they provide you another mail address called public inbox address so you can register any side using this email address so they never know what is your actually inbox address all you just need to so whenever you come to mail in it or website type your inbox name and click on check it so it will provide you all the mail which you received on this public mail id so you can check it anytime and also whenever you think that some of mails are really important to you for example this one you can forward it on your original mail id same way you can do with the gorilla mail forward the mail id so now we understand how fake email services can be used by identity thief and how we can protect our mailbox from junk and spam in my next series 5.1 tutorial i'll cover how we can encrypt our mail messages that will protect ourselves from public email services and security agencies also i'll show some alternative that can be useful to protect ourselves from public email addresses thank you